Now at 11, President Donald Trump expected to land in Saudi Arabia in the next hour or so, and this is what awaits him. American flags everywhere on poles, billboards, even balloons. The president calling his just-fired FBI director a nut job, crazy. That's according to the New York Times. The White House not disputing the report. As the president takes off on his first foreign trip as commander-in-chief, his lawyers are staying behind, Googling the word impeachment. He can jet, but he can't hide. 30 minutes into his flight to Saudi Arabia, two new bombshells landing not far from all the others that have hit his administration this last week and a half. The New York Times reports the president told Russian officials in an Oval Office meeting the day after he fired James Comey, quote, I just fired the head of the FBI. He was crazy, a real nut job, Trump said, according to a document summarizing the meeting. I face great pressure because of Russia. That's taken off, he added. The White House press secretary, Sean Spicer, not denying the account. This seems to confirm that the true reason behind Comey's firing was because he thought it might ease some of the political pressure over the FBI's Russia investigation. Minutes later, the Washington Post came out with its own scoop, reporting that a senior aide to the president is a person of interest in the Russia investigation. New York Magazine later named that aide as the president's son-in-law, Jared Kushner. Kushner had meetings with Russian officials during the transition, which were not disclosed at the time. Late Friday, word the former FBI director will in fact testify in front of the Senate Intelligence Committee sometime after Memorial Day. His testimony will be public, and he's certain to be asked about the memos he wrote detailing his meetings and phone calls with the president. Comey reportedly wrote that the president urged him to let it go when it came to investigating former National Security Advisor Mike Flynn. Trump's also alleged to have pressured Comey to state publicly that the president himself was not under investigation. Meantime, sources telling CNN the president's legal team is brushing up on the process of impeachment just in case. All this as the president embarks on an eight-day, five-stop tour. Trump tweeting this morning, getting ready for my big foreign trip, will be strongly protecting American interests. That's what I like to do. And maybe this trip is just what the president needs to change the subject from the nonstop headlines putting him and his administration in a bad light. One of his top aides saying he's got to hit this out of the park, that this is do or die.